Yes, I can hear you. Okay, uh, good evening, everyone. Thank you for joining us tonight in our community meeting for uh, Overton South, Summer Creek Ranch, and Fox Run Street Improvement. 2018 bond year three contract 12, city project number 101474. My name is Megat Zaki and I am uh, the project manager with the city of Fort Worth, transportation and public works department, capital delivery team. And I will be the project manager for this project during the construction. This, this presentation is meant to provide you with some information about the scope of this project that is happening in your area and uh, give you a little bit of a heads up about the, what to expect with the upcoming construction. In this presentation, I will talk in detail about the project overview and the scope of the work. Also, I will provide you with some information about the phasing and schedule of the construction. So you can know when we'll start and finish the construction in your streets and how long the construction will take in every street. During the meeting, you can send your questions through the op uh, chat option in WebEx. The chat button is located at the lower right side of the WebEx screen here. At the end of the meeting, also I will answer all the questions. If you are joining the meeting from your phone or you cannot send your question, please feel free to unmute yourself and ask your question at the end of the meeting. In this project, we have five streets divided in two areas. The first area is Overton South neighborhood. And in this area, we have four streets as following. Everest Drive, Darla Drive, Burgess Drive, and Albermere Drive. All these four streets uh, start from Wentworth Street all the way to West Haven Drive. The second area in this project is Summer Creek Ranch and Fox Run neighborhoods. And in this area, we have one street, West Kiliburn Road from South Huron to 140 feet south of Medonol Drive. Back to the first uh, area where we have four streets, we are going to replace the sanitary sewer lines in all the streets with new sewer lines all the properties will have new concrete driveways. We will match the existing driveway width with minimum 10 feet length. Also, all the streets will receive new concrete paving with new curbs. On West Cleburne, Cleburne Road, uh, right now the street is in asphalt, so we'll replace the asphalt with new concrete paving and new curbs. Also, we are adding five foot concrete sidewalk on both sides of the, of the street. In addition, all the ramps uh, at his South Huron and Medonol intersection will be replaced with new ramps comply with ADA requirements. In this slide, you can see the existing condition of the street. Um, this picture uh, are from Everest Drive, and you can see clearly the poor condition of the street, damaged concrete paving, a lot of cracks, um, and some area we have asphalt repair uh, spots. On the other photo, you can see uh, the poor condition of the driveways uh, damaged concrete grass is growing between the joints. Here also these photos from West Cleveland Road. Uh, as you know, the, uh, the street is in asphalt, so are, we are going to remove the asphalt and put concrete street. 
Um, as you can see also, there is no curbs. There is no sidewalk on both sides. In this slide, um, you can see the proposed improvement. So every street in this project will look like that when we finish the construction. You will have new concrete paving and the new concrete driveways on uh, on west clipboard node you also will have sidewalk on both sides and new ada ramps here is the most important part in the presentation this slide show you our expected phasing and schedule of the construction uh, the project duration is 300 calendar days or 10 months. Uh, but before I go in detail in this uh, schedule, I would like to make everyone aware uh, that these dates are estimated. Uh, we will do our best to stick with this schedule, but as you know, we may be a little bit late on some streets, or uh, we may be ahead of the schedule on other streets. This will depend on the weather condition and rains during the construction. The good thing here in this schedule is that we are going to start the construction tomorrow, and we are going to start on Everest Drive, and we are expect uh, to finish the uh, construction there on April 28, 2021. The second street will be Darla. And we are we expect to start on November 17th to June 1st, 2021. The third street will be West Cleveland Road, and we uh, will start this street after the holidays on January 5th, with anticipation to complete the construction on April 20, 2021. Burgess Street will start on February 1st. 2021 with anticipation compilation on June 3rd, 2021. The last street in this project will be Albemere, and we will start the construction on March 8, 2021, and the compilation date of this street and the project will be July 18, 2021. Again, the project, the total project duration will be 300 calendar days. Here is my phone number and my email address. Please don't hesitate to, uh, to contact me if you need any information. Uh, also, Aaron Yapara is a city construction inspector on this job, and he will be your first point of contact um, he will be available every day during the construction, so you can contact him very easily. Um, I hope I have covered everything in this presentation. Again, thank you so much for taking the time to listen and join us. Um, and I am so sorry we couldn't meet in person due to the public health concern. And um, now this is the time to listen to your question. Let us start first with the question came from the chat, if we have. And after that, you are welcome to unmute yourself and um, ask your question. Um, Sally, can you, can you please read the questions? Maggie, so far we don't have any questions in the chat. Uh, Do we I have? A, I see a question. Okay, I'm sorry. You're right. Um, will we be able to park in our driveways during the construction of our own street? That's from Jennifer Garland. Uh, most of the time, yes, you will uh, park on your driveway during the construction. Unless we are replacing your driveway, we ask you to park uh, on the other side only during the construction of uh, your driveways. Also, when we're doing the concrete pavement of the roadway, uh, we'll, we'll need you to be out of your driveways for some time there, but we'll give you notice before that happens. We'll put a notice on your door. 
Yes, but most of the time uh, you will have uh, access and uh, you can bark on your driveway. Yes, that is correct. Do we have a call-in user who has a question? Uh, once again, okay, the user watch. whose number ends in six seven. Do you have a question? I can unmute you. Once again, here's my uh, contact information, my phone number, and my email. Also, the city uh, construction inspector, uh, Erin Yabara, uh, his email, email and phone number. You are welcome to contact us at any time. Magid, we have another question. How much yes, of the driveway will be replaced? Is it the entire driveway up to the garage or just the first few feet? Uh, we are replacing only the first 10 feet from the street to uh, 10 feet uh, length, and we are matching the existing width of the driveway. Okay, and then we have another one. Will there ever be a time when we cannot get down our own street? No, oh, your street will never be blocked completely. There will be times that part of the street will be blocked, but you should still be able to go up and down um, just on one side or the other of the concrete. So the contractor is going to submit his uh, traffic control and uh, our, our uh, concern to uh, have an access to all the property during the construction. We are not going to close the street. Uh, during the construction. Okay, Magid, we have another one. Will there ever be an interruption with our water or sewer service? Um, no, there is no interruption during the construction since we are not replacing uh, any of the water. Um, if we have any uh, kind of uh, 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 switch to temporary, we are going to send a notice before uh, the construction. Are we going to put out door hangers? You said the construction is starting tomorrow. We put out uh, hangers on Everest last week. Okay. Yeah. And then moving forward, we'll put them on the other streets uh, seven days prior. Any other question? Uh, Bonnie, are you getting your answers? She says she can't hear what the answers were. I think Justin's talking to her. Yeah, yeah I'm trying to chat with her real quick. Okay. Uh, call in user with the um, last two digits of five eight. Do you have any questions? I'm going to unmute you. No questions. Thank you. Call in user with the last two digits of six seven. Do you have any questions? You're unmuted. Uh, yes. Will there be a sewer drainage? Hello? 
Maggie, yes. did you hear the question? Sewer, sewer drainage. Yeah, will there be any sewer drainage when the water flows down the street? Will there be any uh, water drainage on the street? There currently isn't any. And I live on the uh, north end of the block on the house next to the east end. And whenever it rains, all the water flows. And we're on the low side of the street and the low end of the box. So every time it rains, all this, everything that's in the street settles in front of my yard and the lady's yard next to me at the end of the block. And we're constantly having to sweep and clean up because there's no uh, drainage where the water can you know, go into the uh, sewer drain, drainage like they have on other streets. Actually, we are not adding any uh, inlets, but I believe after we fix the street and uh, construct the curb, the flow uh, go all the way to the inlets. Uh, also, I will, I will be happy if I get your um, property uh, address. So can we go check and with the engineer if we can do it? Forty six zero four. Twenty six zero four. No, four four six zero four. Four six zero four. Everest. Can you yes. can you get your so phone much. number as well? Six eight two three zero four eighty eight sixty seven. Okay. Thank you. And your name? Randy Beckham. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Who is the contractor on the project, Magan? This is McClendon. Uh, okay. I am not sure. This is Justin Blaylton is from McClendon. Uh, I am not sure what is the question. Okay. <laughs> Oh, and I was just telling Bonnie that our our name and who I was with. Yeah, yeah. First one looking at chat. Okay. <laughs> uh, any other question? Not in the chat. Um, I believe we caught both of our call-in users, and they've asked questions. If anyone has a, any more questions, hit us up in chat. So since we don't have any questions, thank you so much for attending this meeting. And we are looking forward to work with you all. Thank you so much. Thank you.